This is a high school player named Nathan. He and his father drove four hours from Houston and, and met me in Dallas. Anytime someone drives a long distance to work with me, I'm always humbled by their trust. Nathan's goal is to gain more hitting consistency in games. He's already a good hitter. We had two hitting sessions in one day. My goal was to improve his hitting timing and hitting spatial alertness. We started the first session by teaching Nathan all the concepts and principles that make up the finish line. When I begin to explain the concepts of the finish line, as they sound simple at first, but very quickly they become very advanced. Next, we spent a lot of time helping Nathan to understand how to master the starting line. Nathan learned how important it is to time your vision and to time the transition, how you go from watching the pitcher to watching the ball. Nathan learned how to use the pitcher's common denominator to count down that moment. Timing the eyes to get into position to see the ball early in the flight path is critical. How effective and how efficient a batter can collect the data about the ball what is the ball's speed and what is the ball's space that's going to occupy determines how well he'll hit in that at bat. One additional concept you see, Nathan wearing a pair of blurry glasses. I studied the blurry glasses test for almost 24 months. The purpose of the blurry glasses is to help the hitter to identify a different hitting mentality. A mentality that says you hardly have to watch the ball all you need is a little bit of information and start processing speed and space. Learn how to train your brain to move faster than the ball is moving. I'm Dave Kirloff, languageofhitting.com.